Hey the guys, Weenio here. Been a little time since we've had a vlog, hasn't it? And actually the most recent community post is probably the closest thing I've done to giving an update on uh, just basically anything really regards to the channel. You know, the one where I talk about uh, fighting people in fast food parking lots, all that stuff. But in case you missed it, Ralph Grawl summed it up by saying, no one cares. Mom, I told you, if you're gonna comment on my YouTube stuff, at least do it on the Weenio's mom account. Don't do it on your personal account. People get really confused. But now for the actual reason why you clicked on this video. You can probably guess by the title that we're going to be talking about the next drinking game. Um, if you saw uh, last time uh, on the live stream, we actually hit the end of the Kingdom Hearts drinking game. I uh, didn't do like that grip, like grand of a speech or anything because I kind of did that at the end of Kingdom Hearts 3 because we kind of thought that was going to be the end. And then Melody of Memory kind of snuck its way in there as a big finale slash revisiting of all this kind of stuff. Anyways, long story short, uh, this many drinks is probably not going to happen ever again. Um, that was rough. It wasn't, well, actually it wasn't that rough because these actually in reality were like sips. So it, uh, it really didn't pan out to be that many drinks in the grand scheme of things, but it definitely ranks up there as one of the most intoxicated I've been, uh, in one of these live streams. So let's talk about what's next. Well, I kind of announced it at the end of the, uh, Kingdom Hearts drinking game live stream, but essentially we're going to be doing the Donkey Kong Country drinking game next. Um, and this one is kind of interesting. I couldn't for the life of me think of multiple rules for this. There's the one simple glaring rule of if I die, I drink. Now, this is a good rule, but um, if my long and storied years of making uh, <laughs> drinking games, which is an absolute fabrication, um, has taught me anything. It's that I need a consistent rule. I need something that's going to affect me throughout the entirety of the game. Basically something that's unavoidable. I think uh, the cutscene trigger words for Kingdom Hearts was kind of like where this relates back to it. You know, something that I can't avoid, essentially, no matter how good I am at the game. And like, I haven't played Donkey Kong Country in a long time, but I have played it quite a bit. So I'm not exactly like bad at it, I guess I would say. So if I did just every time I die drink, this rule would only really affect me kind of in the later half of the game. Uh, not so much in the first couple of worlds, I imagine. I'm gonna make like a bet now that I can beat the entire first world without dying. We'll see how that goes. So I added a second rule. And this one is essentially anytime my banana counter rolls back over to zero, I have to take a drink. Um, this is more of a persistent rule. Definitely will affect the early game as well as the late game. Um, I was contemplating making it just anytime I get an extra life because this actually does equal an extra life. But um, I decided to go with just the bananas rolling over just to keep it more, I guess, consistent. And it kind of gives us a gauge of like how close we are to that next drink. I think that'll be interesting, but you never know. But long story short, bonus rooms are gonna absolutely destroy me, um, especially if I'm collecting the uh, golden statues. <laughs> but this is not gonna be a 100% playthrough. It's literally gonna be just me playing through the game as basic as can be, getting from point A to point B. Um, and this is probably all going to happen in one live stream. Uh, I cannot imagine this taking more than one unless these rules really start to pile on drinks and the later half of the game really kicks my ass. It's a possibility, but I don't see it happening. I think this is just going to be one big long live stream. So when we O'Neill, can we expect this live stream? When is this going to happen? So this, the first of the Donkey Kong Country drinking game live streams. That's right, I did say first, uh, we are going to do the entire series, um, is going to be uh, on February 1st. That is a Thursday, probably going to be happening around noon-ish, if I had to guess. Maybe. <laughs> um, I haven't really fully settled on a time yet. Maybe I'll see what people's response is to this, but uh, February 1st. Um, I'll mark it for noon, but that time might shift around. And if it does shift around, you'll probably see a community post about it. But uh, that's the tentative, uh, tentative definitive date for this. Is that how you say that? Anyways, uh, that's about all the information I had that I wanted to dump on you guys. Um, having a lot of fun with Dark Souls 2. 
uh, trying to get Diablo out of the way. Uh, I've been doing some of the side quests off screen now, uh, or off camera, as I've talked about in those episodes. But uh, everything's kind of chugging along, but January is shaping up to be pretty lackluster, in my opinion. <laughs> uh, I feel like I didn't do a whole lot this month, and uh, we're quickly approaching February, so. Whew, time flies. Anyways, this has been your host, as per usual, we know on this channel. I'll see you next time for the next update, the next vlog, and the next uh, place, time, area. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.